Good morning, everyone. I pray you all had a great weekend. I know I did. Um, had a little bit of self-care morning because I have a very busy day today. So I decided to take a couple of hours to dedicate to just relaxing and getting my workout in and just kind of taking care of myself today. So that's why I'm a little late right now, which is totally fine. Um, Got to take care of ourselves sometimes, right? So that's what I was doing this morning. Um, got in some Bible reading, did my workout, you know, took my time, drank my coffee, all those things. But, uh, oh, there's the cat. She found a way into the video. Do you see that? Yeah, every day. Okay. <laughs> anyway, so today I want to come on here and talk to you and, well, actually show you uh, my refrigerator. Uh, it seems to help out a lot of people. It's not for everyone because everyone's lifestyle is different. Uh, this is just a system that we have found to work for our family and our lifestyle, okay? So we have set up our refrigerator in a way that helps us to make sure that we get our protein, our veggies, and our smart carbs every meal, okay? And it helps Isaiah out because it gives him choice, okay? Uh, a big thing with kids and eating healthy and eating right is to really give them choice. So there's many ways that we give him choice in this, but the biggest way is the way that we've set up our meals, okay? So we have on our refrigerator our customized meal plans and nutritional needs, okay? So those are on the refrigerator, so we have them as a reminder all the time. All right, and they tell us exactly how many proteins for every meal we need, how many vegetables we need every meal, how many carbs we have every, every meal, as well as every fats, okay? So we have that posted, so that way we can utilize that every time. And then our refrigerator is set up with proteins on the top shelf, uh, veggies on the next shelf, smart carbs on the third, and then on the bottom we have fats and fruits just to kind of help out with that, okay? So... We go in and each of us for every meal choose what we want, okay? So there's no set breakfast, there's no set lunch, there's no set dinner or snacks. You go in and you choose what you, not, what you want based on your daily needs, okay? This really helps Isaiah because, yes, he's eating healthy food, but I'm not telling which ones to eat. He chooses every meal. So if you're struggling with kids, um, definitely something to try but I'm gonna turn my camera around and we'll give you a tour okay give me a second okay so like I said we have our guides on our refrigerator that tell us what we need all right and then this is the way it's set up okay on the top we have our protein selection then we have veggies we have smart carbs and we have fruits and fats down here and then the drawers is just food that I haven't prepped yet okay so this is what works for us, okay? And as you can tell, it's all already cooked and prepped. We have figured out that if we don't have to cook, we're more willing to eat nutritious foods, okay? So we take a day where we prep everything, and I found the simplest ways to do it, okay, for, for myself. So we take a day to prep and have everything already done, already cooked, because then we're more willing to eat it. Otherwise, once mealtime comes, we're just like, I don't wanna cook, let's order something, okay? So this seems to help us. All right, so let's get in a little closer. On the top, I buy the two already roasted chickens from Kroger, okay? The Simple Truth brand is great because the ingredients, as you can see, are chicken, water, sea salt, nothing else. Rotisserie chicken is usually something I wouldn't recommend because of the sugar and all of the additives in it. But as you can see, this doesn't have any, okay? Chicken, water, sea salt. That is something I would totally do to my chicken making it at home. So um, I buy two of these already cooked because that just saves me some time. You can obviously, like now I have an Instant Pot, so I might actually just buy a whole chicken now and do it because that's going to save me some money. But if you're more concerned about saving time and having some convenience, these are a great option. Um, just always check the ingredients. Simple Truth is a Kroger or Dylan's brand, so they are awesome. All right, but otherwise, so this is a mix of ground turkey and ground pork, okay? Um, the pork for the flavor, but we don't want too much of that because a lot of fats in there so I mixed it to kind of give some flavor 
but also be on the healthier side. And this is pulled pork, okay? So I buy a giant pork shoulder, I buy some fruit, and I season it and I slow cook that in a crock pot. And then we end up with this massive pan. This is just one, sometimes we have two, so we end up with two massive pans of pork shoulder, okay? So those are all of our proteins that we can just pick and choose um, whatever meal that we wanna eat that, okay? And then down here are our veggies. All right, so we have asparagus, and I oven roast the majority of these, or I steam them in an oven roaster because it's massive and it just makes it so much easier. So we have asparagus, we have green beans, uh, spinach. These are just those coleslaw bags without the dressing, and I just cook those up on a skillet and have it all done and ready as a nice like bowl mix. And then we have Brussels sprouts and some baby broccoli back there. I just like baby broccoli because you can eat the whole thing and it's just easier to prep. All you do is unbind it and throw it in the steamer and you're done. So I really like baby broccoli. And then here are our smart carbs. Okay, um, smart carbs, you definitely want to do whole unprocessed grains if you're doing grains. We, for the most part, do root vegetables for ours. These are sweet potatoes I did in my Instant Pot air fryer. These are plantains I did in my Instant Pot air fryer. Um, we have some potato cakes. We have back there some mashed potatoes. And then this, these back here are brown rice, okay? So all those I cooked in my Instant Pot, it made it take so little time. All right, then down here we have fruits and fats. Um, fats being avocados. And then we have some papaya, blueberries, strawberries. These are grapes and pomegranate, okay? Um, we like to stick with berries for our fruits for the most part because they have higher fiber, lower sugar content, okay? All right, so the way this works is every meal we go in and we just choose what we want. So for breakfast, usually I choose some ground pork for myself, some spinach, and some sweet potatoes, okay? I have a protein, I have a veggie, I have a carb, okay? Always, every single meal, at least one of each, okay? You have all of your nutritional needs just by simply choosing one from each shelf, okay? Um, so breakfast, that's mine. Isaiah, because he needs a higher carb content for Isaiah and Sam, they do um, the ground meat. There's the, see the cat is all excited. Ground meat, <laughs> um, spinach or asparagus, and then they do some sweet potatoes and brown rice, okay? Lunch, all right, I can go in, okay, I want some chicken. Usually I'll have that pulled and taken off the bone just because, yes, we are that lazy. So if it's not off the bone, then we don't eat it. Um, but so just know, your, know thyself, okay? <laughs> know thyself. We are lazy, so I really need to get that pulled and shredded and put into a container so they'll actually be eaten but so lunch chicken i could get some broccoli and i could choose some plantains okay uh dinner so i could have some pulled pork i could have uh, some brussels sprouts and then if i'm really having a sweet tooth i could choose some fruit instead of one of those root vegetables okay and you can mix and match you can obviously do more than one of each uh, I really enjoy making bowls for all of this, but yeah, it's super simple. That's what we do. Um, I know it's not something for everyone. I know a few of my clients are on this system just because it makes their lives easier, but you really have to know yourself. You have to know your family, and it's really a trial and error thing. Um, if you try it and it doesn't work for you, don't give up. Try something else, okay? Everyone is different. All right, well, that is it. Let me reverse here. That is it for the refrigerator tour. I hope that helps. If you have any questions on how to set that up, how to adapt that to your family, your lifestyle, or maybe to work out what works best for you and your family, please message me, love to help. Um, if you need to know what specifically you and your family need, okay? What amounts of each shelf do you need? What's going to work best for your body and your goals? 
please do not hesitate. Reach out to myself. Reach out to my husband, Sam. We would love to help you. All right, guys, that's it for today. You guys enjoy and you have a blessed week. Bye.